Hey, it's Dr. Jonathan Chung coming at you today. Today we're going to be talking about migraine headaches and one of the best unknown things that you can actually do to help address migraine problems. As an upper cervical chiropractor, we see a lot of patients with migraine headaches get a tremendous amount of relief by correcting the head and neck. But there are some patients that still have issues with migraines and they're looking for additional options to reduce their migraine burden. One option that we have found to be really effective is something called vagus nerve stimulation. And one device that we brought into the mold to address it is something called the Gamma Core. So the Gamma Core is something that's been around for several years now, and it's a vagus nerve stimulating unit. So basically what it is, is a little handheld device. What you do is you place the handheld device right at your neck where the vagus nerve exits out. And with as little as two minutes of stimulation, you can do multiple rounds of the stimulation. What we've actually seen is that vagus nerve stimulation can actually knock a migraine down if you get to it in its early phase. And it's something that you do regularly. You could actually take the bite out of chronic migraines and reduce how many headaches you're actually experiencing on a regular basis. And the reason that this happens is because there's some unique factors about vagus nerve stimulation that can help a migraine patient. One of the most um, important roles that the vagus nerve plays is the fact that it activates an anti-inflammatory reflex inside of the body. And when you turn on this anti-inflammatory reflex, some of the inflammatory molecules that get into the brain stem and can stimulate the process of a migraine can actually be knocked down just by using a gentle electrical stimulation of the neck. Now, are there any downsides to vagus nerve stimulation? For the most part, there aren't any contra or any uh, downsides or side effects to vagus nerve stimulation. So for the most part, it is very safe and it can be very effective. The one drawback is there's a contraindication where if you have an electrical implanted device, like if you have a pacemaker inside of your heart, if you have an electrical stimulator inside of your spine for pain, then something like this probably wouldn't be the best fit for you. But for most other patients, it's very well tolerated and people tend to do quite well with it without any drawbacks of something like medication or other things that may have more intense side effects for people that are suffering with migraines.